In this video, we'll write the name for SN8PO42. So there are two things we need to realize here. First, SN, that's a transition metal. And second, we have a polyatomic ion here. This right here is our polyatomic ion. So as we name this compound, as we name SNHPO42, first we write the name of the transition metal. That's just tin. Next, we would write the name for the nonmetal. In this case, we have a group of nonmetals, a polyatomic ion. So we're going to write the name for the polyatomic ion. And you might not know the name for HPO4. If you're allowed, you could look it up on a table of polyatomic ions. So as we look down our list, here's H2PO4, but this is just HPO4. So over here, here's HPO4. It's hydrogen phosphate, the hydrogen phosphate ion. It has a 2 minus charge. So let's write the charge up there. So we know the name of our polyatomic ion. It's hydrogen phosphate. So we'll just write hydrogen phosphate. We're almost done. But since tin is a transition metal, we need to write the charge in Roman numerals here. So we know that the hydrogen phosphate is 2 minus. 2 times 2 minus, that's 4 minus. The tin has to be 4 plus. So we need to write the Roman numeral 4 and then put parentheses around it. So the formula for SNHPO42 is tin 4 hydrogen phosphate. This is Dr. B with the name for SNHPO42. Thanks for watching.